What's cooking, home Gators? I'm Eddie Jackson, former professional football player and celebrity chef. Now, I've teamed up with Kroger for a kick this season by cooking up the most amazing home gaming spread. And to help me create these tasty recipe touchdowns is my friend and former professional football player, Kenny the Hammer Hamlin. How about we get started? I got four words for you. Jalapeno, IPA, caramelized ribs. Yo, Kenny, I know you out there. We can't be together, my man. Times are hard. Tell me what you think about that. What's going on, man? It sounds good. Hey, look, <laughs> when you talk about ribs, I'm all for it. You remember on Thursday nights when we used to watch the college game? We used to have, what was it, uh, chicken and jambalaya? Hey, lion wings, man, of course. But look, you had to cook most of the meals then. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to help out today. All right, so look, I got some St. Louis style ribs that I got from Kroger, right? I love St. Louis style ribs because they have a lot of meat on them. They're very flavorful, right? All right, so I created a rub using the uh, Simple Truth Organic Spices. And what I'm gonna do is sprinkle this rub evenly on both sides. And we're gonna be using the slow cooker today. For me, when you're home gating, tailgating, I think the slow cooker is the best utensil in the kitchen. Okay, from this point, I have the ribs all seasoned up. And I'm gonna put them in a slow cooker. And I already have some that's in there that's been going for about eight hours because I like it low and slow. And what's gonna happen is as it cooks low and slow, we get the drippings, we get the juice. And that's where the flavor is because we use that good, deep, dark, uh, rich rub, which is gonna give us a lot of flavor, right? You're not throwing away that juice, are you? No, my man ain't throwing away the juice. No. It's going in the sauce. Hey, man, hey, Just hey. Just wait, just <laughs> wait, I'm about to show you. I'm gonna start with some sugar and I'm gonna mix it with the beer. It's home getting. You gotta have some beer at the house, right? <laughs> so that's gonna go in and what's gonna happen, kid? I'm gonna let this cook for about six minutes. And because we're using this slow cooker, we're able to use some of these drippings from the ribs that has some of that rub going on in it. I know you said you didn't want no jalapeno, but I gotta have a little bit of jalapeno in here. And we're gonna let this cook and let all those flavors come together. I'm telling you, this is gonna be one delicious sauce. All right, so Kenny, what I wanna do right now is I got this sauce going right here. I'm gonna take these ribs out, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place them on the grill. Hurry up, please. You see that smoke? That's what I'm talking about. Hey, I I'm more focused on, on what you actually put in there. Whatever that smoke seems like, it's gonna get it right. I need to know what you're making, cause I'm over here working. Look, Eddie, I'm not as fancy as you, but you know what? I try to change it up a little bit. So I have some cauliflower here, pre-cut already from Kroger. This is gonna be. Simple, but it has a nice flavor to it. So we have private selection wing sauce. Now this here is gonna give it the kick, give it the nice flavor that it needs. So I'm gonna pour some of this on top of the cauliflower. I already got them roasted, ready to go. Then we're gonna put it back in the oven, make the magic happen. I don't know if you can see that well from over there, but these things are glistening, man. I'm just saying. They glistening? I'm, I'm already ready. But before we get to that, you gotta have some type of dipping sauce to go with them. So we have avocado cream that we're gonna do. So let me put this together. We got your avocado. I like that. Got some nice fat going on in there. You got your coconut milk. And you got a little lime juice. Ah, there you go. Kenny, man, where'd you get so fancy? I hope you look at what, what I'm doing, the preparation that I put in this, whatever, you're a little proud of me because I'm, I'm trying to match your swag a little bit right here. Okay, okay, okay. So, we're gonna get that going a little bit. I'm not a chef, but I can put it together, yeah. make something quick, and we can add to the flavor that you're bringing with them ribs. All right, so Kenny, I'm just gonna put a little bit of this glaze, because it's so good. Got a little spice, got depth of flavor. I'm just gonna add a little bit. You can see how that's just drizzling all over those You're just ribs. gonna keep on doing that, huh? You're just gonna keep on. But I'm gonna go ahead and dive in. You know how we used to do back in there, spread those legs, man. Don't want to mm -hmm. get that, you don't mess up that good shirt. You did your thing, Doc. And, and I'm I'm getting that jalapeno, <laughs> jalapeno right about here. But it's not too much, so you did you did right. Let me get in here. Let me try one of these cauliflower. Let me see what you're working with now. What you think, man? All right, Ken, I gotta tell you. You made me proud. You did a good job. Hey, listen, all the years of you cooking and doing it all by yourself, I had to at least bring a little bit, a little bit to the table, whatever. So you, I'm just hoping you were a little proud of me. So I'm, I'm, I'm happy now. 
Well, look, I gotta thank you. I also wanna thank everybody that's out there watching. And make sure you check out the link below. And if you're taking photos, make sure you tag the hashtag because we wanna see all of those amazing home gating pics. And stay tuned for recipes and tips because we're gonna keep this home gating train rolling all season long. Till next time, peace.